Hello. In this brief tutorial, we're going to talk about Android menu. Uh, in particular, we'll consider options menu tutorial and example in Kotlin. Uh, in this uh, picture, you see how to activate options menu for Android. In the right upper corner, you have these three dots. So by pressing these three dots, you will receive a pop-up menu on the right upper corner with uh, different options. So in this tutorial, we will learn how to create the menu that will look uh, similar to that. So let's build an example of Android options menu. Uh, so first of all, we create a new project. Then you have to create new resource directory in res folder. Uh, right click on res, new resource directory. Uh, directory name is menu and resource type is menu. So right now we go in to Android project, uh, Android, Android Studio. So in the rest folder, uh, here we have right click and we select new Android resource directory. And uh, directory name will be uh, based on the resource type menu. So we don't change anything uh, and don't modify any qualifiers, just press OK. So menu folder has been created. The next step, number three, you have to create a new menu resource. Uh, right click on menu folder, new menu resource file. So we come back to menu folder, uh, right click on menu, new menu resource file. And we just type the same file name menu and press OK. So after that, we will receive a menu XML file with default content, which will be looks like this uh, in the code and in the design. Uh, just nothing is here because we didn't supply any components for the menu at this point. So let's consider the following code for menu XML. Uh, so the menu item uh, that we'll be using will be the following. The first item will be uh, with ID action search. The second item will be action profile. And the last one will be uh, action settings. And we have the same title, uh, search profile and settings. So the first item will have also icon that uh, using just for demo purposes, uh, the icon from uh, uh, res uh, meet map folder. And also it has an option application show as action. Always means this item will be always available on the application bar. So we'll copy this, uh, this uh, information to the current uh, menu XML. So this is our current menu and that's a menu that we just uh, copy pasted right now. So when you uh, have in this line Android icon meet map IC launcher around, uh, this uh, file should be here in meet map uh, folder. So in this case, I just using uh, something default. Uh, switch to design. And in this case, you see this uh, icon will be displayed always as one of the item, which is action search. And the rest of the item action profile and action settings will be activated when you uh, press three dots uh, during program execution. So this is the difference uh, between uh, simple items and items that has icon and show actions always. And the last step, you have to add uh, the code uh, to the main activity to uh, operate using a menu, uh, using options menu. So for this purpose, you will write function on create options menu that will be inflate menu resource. Uh, in my case, it's r.menu.menu. And actions on click menu items required, we will write function on options item selected. So for the uh, different IDs, we will uh, just uh, provide some different actions, uh, change the content of the output uh, text view, and create a temporary uh, message, uh, message show on the screen. The message show just a toast message that display uh, the brief uh, a brief message for the selection. 
So yeah, I inserted the text uh, which required some some important statement. Uh, you have to press Alt Enter when importing this. The same things for the menu. Android view menu uh, should be imported. Alt Enter and menu item. And finally, the same for toast. So what we have here, we have uh, uh, output text view variable uh, that will be just reflecting our selection. Uh, this uh, variable initialized by find you by ID here. So we inflate the menu resource here and we have actions on click menu items, uh, action search, action profile, action settings. Uh, otherwise, we have uh, the user action that was not recognized. Let's run the project and see how menu works uh, in our program. So project is runnable right now. So one of the menu item is always visible uh, using icon. So this is a search. Uh, the toast and uh, output uh, text view. And the other two items, they are not visible. They are visible when you press this uh, three dots, uh, profile and settings. So we're done with this video. Thanks a lot.